Hi, I'm Brian Kent with Flow International. I'm the Director of Business Development for Standard Shape Cutting Systems. Flow has been the world leader in water jet production um, since the early 70s. We're actually celebrating our 40th year here at the IMTS show. Um, during that time, we've watched the water jet evolve. It started as pure water jet back in the early 70s, and then back in 1979, Dr. Mohamed Ushish, who is still our Senior Engineer for Research and Development, developed the abrasive jet. With that, we were able to cut any material on Earth. We can cut everything from tissue paper all the way up to 13-inch steel, titanium landing gears. Any material on Earth can be cut using a flow water jet. Water jet cutting is a cold cutting process. This means there's no heat, there's no metallurgical changes, and there's no additional stresses added to the material. This allows our customers to get a satin smooth edge right off the machine without any secondary process. Due to this, water jet's been one of the fastest growing machine tool processes for the last 10 years. When Flow first started developing the Mach 4 product, we actually wanted to develop the fastest, most accurate water jet in the history of the world. To do that, we knew we needed some strategic partners. The first thing we did was we went out and interviewed over 800 water jet users around the world, as well as Flow customer facing staff, and determined what their needs really were. After we kind of had the needs of the customer, we then focused on the internal technology and we did a, a buy off with a a wide variety of CNC control manufacturers and we wanted to make sure we chose one that was not just state-of-the-art today but gave Flow the power to grow in the future and allow us to make this the number one machine in the world today as well as 10 years from now. So with that after we did a runoff of a variety of CNC control manufacturers we settled on BNR as a partner with this and I say a partner because since the development BNR has been there the whole way and this truly has been a partner. If we look at the machine we started around one direction and um, um, BNR, through their um, continued evolution, has continued to push the envelope both via communication as well as reliability of their products and uh, supported us every uh, step of the way. Um, on the Mach 4, they uh, helped us out with PowerLink and then they also have a, a project called Automation Studio Project. With Automation Studio, it allows us to use the exact same project on the Mach 4 and cover our full continuum of products. So now that we're adapting BNR across the entire product line, we're not starting from scratch on every single machine. We can take the existing product that we've got on the Mach 4 and adapt that all the way down to our Mach 2 series. This has increased the speed of development. It's also increased uh, the time to market as well as reduced the amount of engineering effort as we don't have to duplicate problems we've already solved. If we solve an issue on the Mach 4, that solution is instantly cascaded down our entire product and allows us to have a technology waterfall where we keep pushing the envelope with the Mach 4, but our customers that have an application and a need for a Mach 2 or one of our other series has that same technology. Flow Waterjet can be found on the web at flowwaterjet.com.